Hi everyone, this is Moo Mama Read the Book. The book that we're going to read today is Robotics for Babies by Chris Ferry and Dr. Sarah Kaiser. This is a ball. It is shaped like a circle. Circles are cool. In a circle, we have the center, the radius, the diameter, and the cord. We want more circles, so let's get to work. We will need a piece of paper, a pencil, and a pair of scissors. First, we use the pencil to draw a circle on the paper. Then, we use the scissors to cut the circles out from the paper. This might take a while. How can we make this go faster? Maybe a tool can help. With the tool, we can cut the circle from each piece of paper. This is faster. But the circles are not quite the same. If you look closely, the edge of the circles are jagged. How can we work faster and make the circles exactly the same? Like this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven circles. Maybe a machine can help. The machine will be able to cut the circle from the square. Now they look the same. But Someone still needs to operate the machine. We need someone to pull the knob down to cut the circle. How can we make the machine work by itself? Maybe a computer can help. With a computer, we will be able to introduce an algorithm to the machine. An algorithm will be able to tell the machine to cut the circle from the paper. Now, this is fast and easy. But the paper has moved and this is the spot when the machine will cut the paper so we'll end up with quarter circles or semicircles instead how can we make the computer see the paper this is where the machine will cut the paper but this is where the paper has moved to we give the computer cameras and sensors this is the camera this is the sensor now the computer can find the paper by looking for the edge and the center of the paper. But even though the computer can see the paper, the computer can't move the paper. So what should we do? We give the computer an arm. This is the arm. That should help. Now it's a robot. This system now is called a Robot. Robots make circles faster, better, and automatically. Look at the numbers of circles that the robots can generate. Now you know robotics. The end. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, remember to subscribe and like. Bye bye.